Hello there and welcome to the new Google Data Studio tutorial and in this tutorial I want to show you how you can share your data with other developers. So suppose you are part of a big organization where in your department multiple teams are engaged into the development of various different types of dashboards and in that case they may want to use the work which has already been done on any of the existing data source so that they don't have to do that work again. So in that case, how you can share the data source is what I will going to show you over here. So for that, what I am going here is uh, datastudio.google.com uh, and this is the main page from where we can create the report and all. And here you have the option of data sources. So in the data source, as you can see, we have super sales order, returns, and a lot of different data sources with which we have worked. Now, if I want to share this um, sample superstore, where I need to basically come over here, and I need to choose the option share. And as you can see, it has multiple options. So the first option is uh, adding the people, and you can enter the name and their email address over here, and uh, specify whether they can only view or edit, right? So when you choose only view, that means they can just read the data. And uh, when you choose the edit, that means they can make some edits. So depends on um, how well uh, you trust the another individual as and the roles which is assigned to the other individuals, you can accordingly choose this. Now you have the manage access where you can specify at a general level that uh, you want to make it off or you have like anyone on the internet can view and find it and anyone on the internet find and edit so on and so forth right so this is a little risky just be sure that if you are doing it you are sure what you are doing about that and then you have the option that prevent editors from changing the access and adding new people and disabling uh, downloading printing and copying of for viewers so that uh, they are they are not able to download and uh, print it let's say if this is a sensitive information or the sensitive data and then uh, the added report option that means uh, it will show you in which reports this data source has been added so we have worked with the sales performance dashboard and the untitled report just for the demonstration of some techniques so if you don't want that uh, we can just remove that so that we are just sharing the data source so based on these different settings, you can choose what makes sense most for you and accordingly share your data source with the other developers. So that's about it about how you can share the data source. And now I'll meet you in the new video with the new topic.